In this video, we present reconfiguration motion planning for variable topology truss. This work was done by Chao Liu and Mark Kim. Variable topology truss is a new class of modular robotic system. A VTD is composed by multiple linear actuators for the truss members which are joined at the truss nodes by a special reconfigurable spherical joint. In a reconfiguration process, a single node with a sufficient amount of members can undock into a pair of nodes, and two separate nodes in the truss can dock to form one node which connects all of the involved members. This is inspired by DNA replication process. In a DNA replication process, topoisomerase can change the topology of DNA by cutting and resealing strands as tanglements form. This inspires us to make use of this special property to do reconfiguration planning with not just geometry reconfiguration actions, but also topology reconfiguration actions. Here is our hardware demo to show the capability to change the topology of a VTT. A VTT can be modeled as an undirected graph composed by multiple vertices and edges. There are three atomic actions for an individual node, move, split, and merge. With these reconfiguration actions, the number of nodes can change. However, the members in the system are physical elements which cannot merge or disappear so that the number must remain constant. We develop a new approach to dislocate the whole space considering the overall geometry of a VTT to generate cells with different sizes so that a truss in an irregular cubic shape can be represented as a regular cube in grid space. This can avoid too many small cells to be generated. It is hard to compute collision-free space of a node in a VTT due to the complexity of the truss structure and the high dimensionality of the system. We solve this self-collision check problem by a simple geometry approach. During a motion, each involved member will sweep a triangular area, and we just need to check the intersection between this triangle and all other not involved members. If no intersection, then this action is a collision-free action. With all the previous work, we can build our transition model. Given a motion task and a VTT, grid space can be generated. Then first convert this VTT into a VTT in grid space, then apply action and check some constraints, like collision-free, to generate a new VTT in grid space, and finally convert it back to a new VTT choice in Cartesian space. A graph search algorithm based on A star framework is presented to find the optimal sequence of discrete actions given the initial VTT and the goal VTT efficiently. Here are two of our simulation demonstrations. This work was sponsored by AFOSR grant.